Scott, three points, a win away from home. Yeah, um, that was a task. Um, and scored some really good goals today. Um, we did a lot of analysis work on on them and, and felt that there were spaces in the box that we could score goals from. And I think if you look at all three goal, all three goals, especially the first two, you know they found space in the box and kind of good balls in from the right hand side from both sides, uh, from the right hand side on both of them goals, and and we found space in the box. And I thought we finished our goals really well. Some some great resilience from your side, particularly after maybe a disappointing first half. Yeah, I actually thought that we were just getting into our momentum when they scored. I thought it was a bad time for us, really. I thought that we were just starting to get into it, and um, obviously they scored off a, off a free kick. We've been really good on defensive set pieces, and we do a lot of work on it. So we're disappointed with that. I thought we could have done better in the moment, um, but I thought that we we continued to play our way. I thought we controlled the first half. I thought there was times. We maybe could have played, their, their defensive line was quite high, so I thought that we, that on the top line we made some really good runs, but we never really found them. I thought we tried to play along the floor, through them from bigger distances, and, and consequently it turned over. So I just thought that we, there was a little tweak where I felt that we could be a bit smarter with our play. Um, but no, listen, I can't complain. I thought the effort from the lads was class today. Not sure what you said at half time, but it, but it clearly worked. You can't ask for a, for a better start to, to a second half than that. Just a few tweaks, really, within our play. I felt that we we turned down. You know, there was a lot of runs on the top line. You know, there was a lot of runs made by the, the players who play at the top of the pitch, and we we kind of turned them down a lot and played in front of the opposition. In my opinion, too much. The times that we did get in in behind them in the first half, we ended up with a shot or a or a throw in or some more territory up the pitch, um, and I felt that we could have done that better. Um, I don't think we passed the ball particularly well in the second half as well as we did in the first half, but we were more aggressive with our play and we got we got three goals, so I, I can't complain. No, no, a, a lovely way to, to finish it off and, and, and have that real moment with the fans at the end. Yeah, great. A lot of fans are class today. I mean, I, it looked, I don't know how many was there, but it looked obviously packed in that little corner. Um, but they were brilliant. They never stopped singing the whole game, literally the whole game they sang. Um, and this is a... A tough place to come. The Grimsby fans are usually really loud, and I couldn't hear them. Couldn't hear them. All I could hear was our lot, and they were brilliant. And I'm really pleased that we've sent them down the road with three points. Quick word for Sam Sharon coming into the side today. His first league start under you. How do you think he got on? I thought he was excellent. You know, he wasn't planned to play. If I'm honest with you, um, we'd planned for Nico to play. Nico had a little bit of a tight hamstring yesterday and pulled out of the training session, so we had to make um, a, a change with that. And, and you know Sam wasn't in the squad originally, um, and he's such a good pro. I, I said to him, "Look, you're gonna you're gonna get your opportunity now." And I said, "You need to go home and get your stuff because obviously we were travelling on the day." He said, "No, I've brought it just in case." So it just goes to show how prepared he was, um, and I'm really pleased for him because he's been patient um, and he's trained well, and he's a good lad. And I thought he played really, really well today. And just finally, Scott, three wins on the bounce now for your side. Preparation doesn't come much better than that for a big game against AFC next week. Yeah, no, that's what we wanted. Um, but three's not not where we want to be. We want to be winning a lot more than just three on the bounce. We want to be, we want to continue that, you know. Uh, but yeah, we're in a good place. The, the, the dressing room's bouncing, as you can imagine. Um, and it, it sets us up for, for next week against, uh, against Wimbledon in the, in the FA Cup. So now we're really pleased. Scott, very well done today. Thank you.